good morning to my friends thanks to all of you for honoring my videos please continue to do so because it gives me lot of energy and enthusiasm to produce more videos in this video i would like to speak about interview skills of course all of you might be well aware for the sake of urban and semi urban students i want to make an attempt to give some tips so that they can enter, attend interviews uh, with much vigor and also strength all of you know well that the communication is most important everywhere nowadays so this is the first skill that one has to develop and our video lessons mainly focus on that only okay so for that purpose today i want to speak how communication skills play vital role in interviews most of the candidates develop a kind of fear tension stress and shyness to attend interviews primarily because they are very much afraid of their flow of expression and also how to answer questions need not fear for all these things there is one panacea i mean there is one remedy if you have a little bit command over english language you can attempt any question but while attempting or answering your answer should be straight and you need not get confused and confuse the interview board for example you see suppose the interviewer asks a question on self introduction there you must be very clear about you you should not start like this myself i am vijay kumar my father is a teacher my mother is a housewife my hobbies are playing cricket chess like this you should not tell you must always use expression i am vijay kumar i have completed my sslc or any other degrees in so on so institution or university my hobbies are this like that you have to start most of the people are mistaken and they use i myself it is quite wrong and whenever the question is asked you take a little bit gap and answer straight you need not beat about around the bush i mean your answer should be very crisp and sh short for example they ask you about your hobbies you should not list out hard working motivation music playing cricket some people say watching tv no it is not you must use a sentence i like this i like that when you use like that the interviewer would estimate your personality where you are exactly and then only what happens you know interviewer may take decision whether you will be given selection or not the next most important point is thinking skills you know usually we have two ways of thinking positive thinking and negative thinking so whenever any question is asked you must take it in a positive way you should not take it in a negative manner long back what happens a gentleman attended an interview the interviewer asked one question if you are not selected what is your reaction then that man without any hesitation he said i would take revenge on interview board is it correct answer no i don't think so it is not correct politely you can say that i would try my level best again like that we have to give answer and another point here you must make note in our thinking suppose you can't understand and a question then how you have to ask you must ask politely please repeat the answer or i beg your pardon like that we have to ask some people say please repeat it no it doesn't look nice then your attitude should be positive throughout interview then only you can do well otherwise you cannot do so these uh, thinking skills uh, play an important role and even before going for interview you must adjust your thinking level even when question is asked you must be very active in molding the answer in a proper way 
The third one is body language. Body language, you know well, when you attend some interview, whether man or woman should wear formal dress and you must keep smiling and there should be a kind of glow in your eyes. Even when you enter, you must ask politely, may I come in, sir? And then when they offer you chair, you must sit straight and put your hands on your lap and even your file also on the table and you must have eye to eye contact with the interview members. So when you look at them, automatically they get a kind of pleasure to ask questions. Whenever the question is asked, you should not show a kind of negligence. You must attack the question in a simple manner suitable to the situation. Even you can't answer all questions, you need not worry about it. Usually most of the candidates, what they develop, a kind, they develop a kind of fear inside and sweat will be there on the face and their hands shake and they become emotional sometimes, nervous. So this thing should not be laid. In body language itself, you should show your maximum courage. I repeat again, a smile a day keeps the doctor away. You keep on smiling. When you smile and answer, even the interview board uh, gets a kind of impression that you should be given selection. Nowadays, the way of asking questions may differ from person to person. Suppose a new candidate, they test mainly about his uh, uh, background, I mean personality, about subject knowledge and other things. When you go to technical field, I mean software field, they ask mainly about your technical experience or any project work, uh, project work done before or what you are going to take, what is your impression, these things they speak. And you know that in the present industries, a uh, candidate, I mean uh, a job holder may not stay in single, I mean a company. They keep on changing because they want a hike in their remuneration for that purpose. So when they attend such interviews, the interview, interviewer may ask more about the earlier project works and what are their targets and how they are going to lift the company. These questions they ask. So for all these also, they have to answer in a proper way. Of course, when you come to the person who has already job, he or she might have a lot of experience. But for the fresher, what to require? These three tips, I mean, fine communication skills, thinking skills, and body language. That is most important. And why I'm giving in a crisp way, so that we can follow these uh, tricks well, I mean, tips well, and if you want more, you can uh, go through some of the books, some of the magazines where, can, where you can find a lot. Just for information sake, I'm dealing the subject interview self for your purpose. And usually what you, you know well that interview means it is only between two persons. So there you can develop a kind of formal conversation. When you enter even, you should politely say, my come in sir, and you have to start. So that way you can develop a kind of communication or attachment between the interviewer and interview. So before saying goodbye to all, let me share one point here, my dear friends. Here you have been observing my videos. Uh, my videos uh, do not have decoratives or bright background. And let me tell you frankly, with much humility, I am doing all these recordings in my department. English department which I love best so please keep continue responding to my videos I'll be very happy thank you so much